We host an event each year called the Emergency Room Trauma Simulation Lab. It's hectic in there. There's a lot of noise, especially when there's a bunch of things going on at once. They put us under lots of pressure. Though we're not taking them to the hospital setting, we've recreated it using standardized patients and family members in real life situations and scenarios. I was trying to, to do my work as a police officer. I focused on the patient first, to figure out what they needed, and then as things began to come along, I'm like, okay, I think we need to get social work involved. The huddle was a great opportunity that we had right around the middle of the simulation. We got together with the nurses and the criminal justice and the social workers, and the social workers talking to the patients, and then I think they got criminal justice involved. This year, we were able to use the 12-bed emergency room in the new Carruthers Science and Nursing Building. Really good portrayal of what it's like to be in an ER situation. We were really able to use our crisis intervention skills. We've really learned what it's like to be holistic with our patients and know how to care for them, the whole person. Learning about the culture and how to deal with people from different culture, that gives you the opportunity to uh, to communicate well with them. Everyone just has a very specific skill set and just being able to see how those skill sets really intertwine and how easy it was to work with them as well. It's a wonderful resource to help equip our students in the preparation for becoming a social worker. It really was a confidence booster for us. This will most definitely prepare me for my senior field placement that I have starting up next year.